Hello everyone, this is Garrett and this is Serious Sam, the First Encounter Classic Edition. And we're loaded 211, wanted me to do me to do a video in his voice in the entire time. And I'm not gonna do that. So we are in this level, which is uh, thinking about probably one of the harder ones on mental actually. Partially because quite a lot of things spawn when you actually pick up stuff, even though you can actually make this part considerably easier. And that is just by kind of taking a large turn around it by basically just going there to the only secret in the area, spoilers. Um, you know, area, I mean level, basically. One secret, entire level. Awesome. And, um, yeah, you'll basically not spawn quite a lot of things, but, you know, this is in the, um, idea of murdering as much as possible. And that is exactly what we're gonna do, but I do expect this to potentially go a little bit wrong. Just a bit. In fact, almost certain of it, to be perfectly honest, because I really don't know where things are going to spawn. I very, very rarely do this properly, because this is tedious, and I'm just not very good at remembering things like this when I don't do them very often. So, this could be interesting. Uh, what I do vaguely remember is stuff spawning over there. <laughs> Which is why I'm kind of in the side here, because nothing really spawns over here so far, and that makes me very happy. Also, as I said before, we only have ammo for the shotgun, because the story said so. Which is why I'm not using anything else but the shotgun right now, and I still hear music, even though everything I can see is already dead, which is not good, because this probably means something's gonna sneak up on me in a second. Oh, uh, well... Uh, play a skeleton! Don't kill me! This could actually be really bad, considering the NARS will actually be really in the way when trying to shoot these clears, and the clears, um... Well, the NAR will die, and the clear will then just jump over towards you and try and murder you horribly, which is not really the most pleasant of experiences, as you can probably imagine. Another one of those things which is not the most pleasant of experiences is having to kill this green guy with pistols, because... Well, while not too difficult when you've taken care of everything else, it's not really the fastest method of killing these guys. Okay, apparently he jumps down. That's kind of an odd strategy. Probably because I, I was taking so much time killing him that he just got bored and tried to punch me in the face at this point. But we managed to take him down. Not too much damage taken yet, which is good. And I'm going to go over there because this is the secret area of the level. And it actually contains some ammo for a rocket launcher, I believe. Though I also believe it also spawns some rather horrible nasties, which is kind of a bother, but I'm sure we'll be fine. I mean, so far we haven't really taken too much damage yet, our health is almost reaching normal levels again. And it's not like the hard part of this level doesn't start until that point in the middle over there, so yeah. Ah, so much fun, but we'll see what happens. Also, blowing up this tree does nothing. Just saying. I have tried it many times and nothing has happened in any of those attempts, sadly enough. It has made me very sad and sad, and that was the worst aiming in aiming history, actually. I ooh, those are rockets. Maybe I should look behind me and see what is shooting these rockets towards me. Because that would probably not be very good if it hit me. Alright, where are you? Those are dead. I'm gonna kill you with a shotgun. I will do it the manly way. I will do it the serious sound free way. Killing you with a shotgun, although this is not going extremely extraordinarily well so far. Well, uh, at this point it's not too bad. And there's a 50 health power up further up ahead anyway, so doing this shouldn't matter too much. Yeah, okay. <sighs> it's just kind of a shame I got rid of my armor that way, but oh well. I'd rather have a little bit of extra rocket launcher ammo than, um, well, health, <laughs> really. I mean, rockets are kind of useful in this place, uh, as you will soon see. Because I do believe- oh, there's some more rockets over there as well, but eh, I kind of want to have some extras because I do believe there's going to be some rather unpleasant things going to come towards us and all that stuff. Of which, some of which are bulls, if I remember correctly, and uh, yeah, would rather not have those kill me too much. This is quite a lot of clears. Um, <laughs> maybe I should use a rocket on these guys, but I think I'm, I am going to play it very safe in this level because... I know what's coming up, and I'd rather have as much health as possible. 
Even though I said earlier that I didn't really mind that I lost some health or some armor over there, but I don't care. But basically, health is rather important soon. I'm just gonna shoot three rockets in the hope that it clears stuff up a bit. And I think it did, a little bit at least, so that's good. Just gonna do a little quick save in action. And hope I don't die, really. That's uh, my plan of action. But I am basically going to be running back and forth continuously, trying to get rid of as much enemies as possible without taking too much damage, because... Well, the next part is just going to be horrible, really. I mean... There's a, basically, this is one of those three-part areas, which is a large open area, then a small enclosed-ish area, and then a large open area again. And... While well, the first and the last part aren't too bad, the middle part could be rather disastrous on mental, because of stuff you'll see soon enough. But to say it is well, to basically put it into as an easy to understand conclusion, stuff's gonna kill me and it's a rather unpleasant combination of enemies that's gonna try and kill me. And something's falling when I picked up that armor. And I can't see it, but it sounds like a bull. And now it no longer sounds like I thought I heard a bull there, but I know there's gonna be bulls. I know there will be bulls later on, so that's why I'm basically rather frightened of them, but I'm almost certain I vaguely remember there being some bulls laid earlier on as well. So, eh. I don't know when they're gonna come. What I do know is that when you run backwards when fighting against players, they will continuously try to use their projectile attacks, and as such, they will not really pose as much of a threat as when they're nearby you, so... That is basically my reason as to why I'm continuously running back, especially since when they reach a certain amount of damage, they will get stunned. As you saw there, um, they will make a little wow sound, and when that happens, you have uh, just a little bit safer, really. Uh, this is kind of bad, actually. This is really not very nice. Would have liked if I didn't take that damage, but oh uh, well. It's too late now. I've already taken it, so now we're just gonna have to do it a little bit more carefully than before, which is a bit of a bother, but oh well. I miss having guns. That's a, a, kind of an odd thing about the HD remake as well, I'm not sure if I mentioned this in the previous video because it's been a few days since I recorded that, is that for some reason you get cannonball. You get, um, yeah, cannonball, uh, cannonballs, not cannonball ammo, you get cannonballs, um, which is cannon ammo, as you can probably imagine. And that is really quite useful to have here because, yeah, lots of scary things and stuff. But I always thought that was a bit weird, considering you lose all of your ammo, and the story is definitely still the same. I, I mean, the cannon is a secret weapon, but it, even if you uh, got it and you used up all your ammo in the previous level, you will actually get some extra cannonballs for, the, for this level for some reason. I have no idea why. I always thought that was a bit strange, but I guess maybe that's a bug or something, maybe they didn't... Um, include any numbers on that or something, I don't know. It's very strange, but, uh, yeah. Basically, in the HD remake, this level is a lot easier. Especially so when you don't really have too much ammo to begin with because you're not playing on serious difficulty, or tourist. And, yeah. If you want to play the easier version, play that one. Although, yeah, I don't know. The thing is, the I think I still think that the HD remake is easier because of the way the engine works. Because these enemies don't hit the same way in the well, they do the same sort of animation to attack you, but the way they hit is different in the sense that in the HD remake, the part of their body that actually hits you is considerably more specific than in this game. Where in this game, it's basically if any part of their body touches you while they're flailing at you, it will take you will take damage. Whereas in that game, quite a lot of times, if you just jump slightly before they, uh, or actually slightly after they start jumping at you, you will kind of hit the top of them, and they won't deal any damage. And it's really strange. And other times, it will actually deal damage, even if they've stopped moving entirely. So I don't, I don't know how their damage works at all in that game. It's very strange, but whatever. Also, this guy spawned ages ago, which is kind of rude. And I am taking this very carefully because that person can deal a fair amount of damage. Fortunately, it takes a while for the arachnoids to aim at you, and therefore they didn't shoot at all, which is good. 
No scary things just yet. I know when I pick up that cannon over there, which you can barely see. I'm not even sure if you can see it in the video. Uh, basically bad stuff's gonna happen, but we're not there yet. Uh, <laughs> I hit, uh, did I hit two purple guys with a rocket launcher or something? That was very strange. I'm not sure what was going on there. And those were the bulls I guess I was talking about that I knew were going to spawn at some point, but I wasn't really sure when. Hmm, should I pick up that armor? Probably not, actually. I think I'll leave that armor there for now, unless stuff doesn't spawn. Actually, I'm gonna see if stuff spawns when you pick up the armor or not, because... Right, that happens when you pick up the armor, and that happens when you don't pick up the armor. <laughs> Great! Okay, uh, I guess I'll pick it up then. Uh, so many bad things shooting at me. Man, I do not like Cap- Oh man, if there's anything behind me, I'm gonna be in a lot of trouble. And yeah, this is <laughs> pretty much a good way to see that when you don't pick up things in this level, it is considerably nicer than when you do. And I- I guess that's always just kind of been a reason why I've just avoided everything. Just gone for the secret area and then the next thing I pick up was a cannon. Because that's really- the cannon is the only thing you need to pick up because that spawns the enemies you need to kill for the door to open to the next area, so... Eh. Please don't kill me, it's very rude. Me? Oh, hey. But yeah, honestly, if you're going for a leaderboard score, then I guess it makes sense to do it like this, but otherwise I would just recommend taking the easy route, to be perfectly honest. And leaderboards weren't actually introduced until, um, what's it called? Until my cat started meowing really loudly. One moment. <clears throat> leaderboards weren't really introduced until the HD remake anyway, so if you're playing the classic edition, I would definitely recommend... Look at the size of that thing! ...looking at the size of that cannon that we already... We've already seen this because we already have one, but, you know, it's serious Sam, so it's okay. Um, not really sure how I should go along to doing this because I know it's gonna. Sp oh, those spawn when you pick up the ammo. Okay, new plan. So, basically, cannonballs kill bulls in one shot, regardless whether or not you charge it. As I have mentioned before, if you do charge it and it hits nothing, you can actually kill one of the um, what's it called? One of the uh, red biomechanoids with it as well. Which is very useful indeed. I'm just waiting until it gets as close as possible before using it to conserve my ammo as much as possible. Because it's kind of a lot of bulls here. Not gonna lie, a lot of bulls. And while the rocket launcher is a pretty good and effective weapon to kill bulls, there's kind of a lot of them. So, yeah, I would suggest killing the first couple of waves at least. Just with the cannon. And from that point on, switching to the rocket launcher, so you at least have some cannonballs left for the next area. Well, not really the next the next area, but the area kind of after that, because the next area doesn't really have anything that you really need to kill with the cannon, I guess. It's, it might actually be fairly useful for certain parts, because it does get a little hectic if you don't take care of things quickly enough. And... I don't know. It, it, I think it's gonna probably going to be a good idea to just have some emergency cannonballs, basically. Because there's going to be things... It, it's just a horrible combination of enemies that's going to be coming towards us, basically. And I'm not sure what's going to happen. I'm honestly not sure. I think I will probably die. And um, In fact, I think I'm actually going to make a proper safe fall in front of this area. So if I actually get that tired of this area and not finish it at all <laughs> during this session, then I'm just gonna load the save file again. So, yeah, let's see if I make it in one try, and if I don't, then I'm gonna sound very grumpy while continuing from this area. So let's go. Okay, um... Right. So, right now we really only have shotgun ammo and some rocket launcher ammo, as you have probably noticed. And two cannonballs, and the rocket launcher ammo is running kind of low as well, because we used a lot of it on the bulls. Not really a lot of stuff going on, I think there's some shotgun ammo over there and there, and I think there's some armor power-ups here and there as well. But, <sighs> let's stop being lazy and just do with this, because... Yeah. Uh, basically, what goes on here is stuff spawning all around you quite a lot. And the combination of enemies that I was talking about, which is rather horrible, is clears and kamikazes. And the reason why this is horrible is because kamikazes deal a lot of damage, and clears deal a lot of damage too! And uh, that clear actually killed a kamikaze, which is nice of him, but... 
even then, this combination is not something I really like. You really have to be careful with the kamikazes. I honestly would recommend just avoiding the clears at first, unless you really can get a clear shot at one of them. Get a clear shot, ho-ho! But, um, yeah, make, just, I honestly would recommend taking these out first, even though the clears will, oh god, yeah, and that's why I need cannonball. Now I remember, there are enemies that you do need this for, because it just makes, did I just miss, seriously? What? How did that miss? Ser what the hell is that? I don't know. Anyway, um, as I was saying, clear, uh, clear, come, come, blah, blah, Let's do a quick save. What the hell was that? I have no idea. And there's going to be more bulls if I remember correctly, so do to keep that in mind. I am kind of glad I got at least two cannonballs left for this area because otherwise I would not be doing very well because killing um, killing bulls in this area with a rocket launcher is really annoying because the clears will get in the way quite a lot as you can probably imagine and as such you will probably shoot yourself in the face more than you will actually hit a bull so eh. so far this is not going too bad though I would have expected this to go worse to be perfectly honest, because I'm not very good at this part, especially when I can't see anything. So, yeah, so far, I, I don't know. expected this to go a lot worse, which is why I made that safe fall and everything, because I have died horribly in this area many times in the past. And that's when I had twice as much ammo and was playing in series, not when I was playing on mental, so, yeah. So, oh no, I'm not really, um, except for that weird miss with the bull. I thought there were more bulls as well. I really thought there were more than just, um, maybe those come now or something. I don't know. But yeah, uh, that went okay. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna make a little quick save over here before picking that up because I can't imagine anything good is gonna spawn when I pick this up.